When it comes to whole home and portable power solutions, Jackery is easily one of the most trusted names in the game, and personally, they're one of my favorites. So of course, I was super excited to partner with them here at CES for a full booth tour. Now, walking into the booth, the first thing that pulled me in wasn't even the tech, it was the live DJ. He brought so much fun and energy to the space, and it really set the tone for what Jackery's doing this year. If you've been watching my coverage, here at CES 2026, it seems like the main focus has been on AI and humanoid robots. Jackery actually had a bot of their own, albeit one that actually makes sense and could really fit into my current lifestyle. We'll talk more about that here in a minute. First, let's talk about keeping your home running when the grid goes down. This is the Essential Home Backup 3600 Plus. If you're looking for something that can power your entire home during an emergency or a blackout, this is definitely the answer. The capacity here is massive. You can scale it from 3.6 kilowatt hours all the way up to 21 kilowatt hours. In real world terms, that means you can keep your essential devices running for anywhere from one day to two full weeks, depending on your usage. It puts out between 3,600 and 7,200 watts, which is enough to handle heavy power devices like your AC or heater, what I love is how integrated it is. You can pair this with the manual transfer switch to power your critical circuits directly, plus you can hook it up to two Solar Saga 200 watt panels or the 500X panel for faster charging. For me, the 3600 Plus is the go-to for home backup. It bridges the gap between a portable power and those massive permanent home installations. It keeps your lights, fridge, and devices running without taking over your entire garage or requiring a construction crew to get it installed. Next, they showed me something that completely rethinks outdoor solar. This is the solar gazebo. It looks like a stylish outdoor space for relaxing or entertaining, but that roof isn't just for shade, it's a full solar power station. The roof panels can deliver up to 2,000 watts of solar capacity. Jackery says it can generate up to 10 kilowatt hours of energy per day, and doing the math on this, 10 kilowatt hours is enough to add about 30 miles of range to my Cybertruck, that's incredible for free energy from the sun. While I'm hanging outside, it charges a Jackery 5000 Plus so that energy is banked and ready whenever I need it, day or night. They also tricked this thing out with some unique options like built-in blinds and a pull-down projector screen. It's basically the ultimate backyard flex. You're cooling off and entertaining guests all while generating enough power to run your house or charge your EV. Next up, let's talk about durability. This is the Explorer 1500 Ultra and it's without a doubt the most durable portable power station that I saw at CES. It's rated at IP65 for dust and water resistance and boasts level nine shockproof durability, but you guys know me, I don't just read the specs, I actually test them out. Jackery actually let me put this thing through the ringer. First was the water test. They had water running on this unit 24 seven. It felt a little unnerving spraying water directly onto a power station like this, but it handled it perfectly. Then there was the desert setup to test dust resistance, which it shrugged off, but the real test happened at the rock pile. They had the unit sitting on these jagged rocks for display, and naturally I asked if they'd be okay with me doing a drop test. To my surprise, they happily obliged. I picked the 1500 Ultra up and dropped it from about two feet onto the rocks, made a huge crash that startled everyone within earshot, but when I picked it up, it was unscathed. It still worked perfectly and I actually had to repeat the drop test a few times to get the right camera angles, so this thing took a beating. Even with the jagged edges of the rocks, it only walked away with a few minor scratches. That's super impressive. This unit is built for off-road adventures, remote work, or do-it-yourself projects. It can easily run heavy draw tools and critical gear like Starlink, keeping you online even in the middle of nowhere. And finally, we have to talk about that show-stopping robot that I mentioned earlier. Meet the Jackery Solar Mars Bot. After two years of research and development, this updated bot isn't just a concept, it's a glimpse into the future of autonomous energy. Most solar panels just sit there. If the sun moves, you lose efficiency, but this little guy is fully intelligent and autonomous. It uses a built-in PV ESS system and light tracking mechanism to actually find the sun. It moves and thinks for itself to ensure it's always getting optimum charging, Imagine a future where these bots are wandering your property, acting as intelligent charging companions for your devices, your outdoor tools, or even your next-gen humanoid robots. It's designed to capture, store, and deliver power efficiently, ready to support everything from portable Starlink setups to everyday Internet of Things devices. For creators and tech enthusiasts like me, this kind of setup is definitely the dream. 
The Solar Mars bot isn't just about power, it's about autonomy. It's the kind of tech you didn't know you needed until you see it in action. Jackery is clearly thinking about the entire ecosystem from the rugged 1500 Ultra to the futuristic Solar Gazebo and the Mars bot. I'd love to hear your thoughts. How would you use a solar bot that follows the sun? Let me know in the comments below. I'll leave links to all this gear in the description. That about wraps it up for this video. Thanks guys for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.